Well, grab a cold one and listen to this. Could hops be Florida's next big cash crop? Researchers at the University of Florida are looking into how to make it happen. Locally grown hops could dramatically decrease costs for local brew houses. News 6's Troy Campbell is taking a look at the research. The setup. Yeah. It's pretty impressive. Thank this you. This must have been quite a task to get together. Yeah. Moving it around is the hardest part. Charles Frizzle says he opened Broken Springs Brewery in Orlando back in 2016 after graduating from the Rosen School of Hospitality. My grandfather was a brewer, so I knew if he could do it, I could do it. And you went to a school of another local entrepreneur, graduated, well, and now basically, you have yeah, Rosen a College is a local here. entrepreneur, and the hospitality program has the beer course, and that kind of set me on this path. Researchers at the University of Florida's Institute of Food and Agricultural Sciences say microbrewing in Florida has become a $4 billion a year industry. There's always going to be a need for this ingredient. Assistant Professor Catherine Thomas Whitrick helped kick off the study in 2023, growing hot plants inside greenhouses. These college students even took part in a blind test of hot pallets grown here in Florida. We're trying to be able to, I guess, trick the hot plant into thinking that there's more daylight by putting them into greenhouses with superior lighting sources. These hot pellets were shipped in from Washington State, but researchers at UF, they want this product to be grown locally here in the Sunshine State. So when people here in Central Florida go to a local brewery, they can have something that's locally sourced and it can also lower the cost to ship it in for small business owners. UF says the hops have already been used at a brewery and the feedback has been positive. Customers like the fact that they find out that the hops were grown in Florida. Do you think that that would be something your customers would also like? Yeah, I think it's always helpful. We try to use as much local ingredients as we can. In Orlando, Troy Campbell, Getting Results News 6.